I remember my first experience at the Mattress Factory. Um, I was 22, about. Uh, I had just graduated, and I was trying to figure out where I, um, where I could fit in the contemporary art world um, as someone who's deciding to, to create art. Um, so I just remember coming in at the time Ayana Moore's installation was up and uh, I was just blown away uh, by her work. And I didn't know she was a, a black artist at the time, but I think I, I met her shortly after and um, uh, I was like, hey, I, I think I ran into your work. Are you showing at the mattress factory? And she just looked at me and smiled. And I just remember uh, knowing that the mattress factory was somewhere that I could uh, eventually show as well, um, that uh, it was a space that could hold me. I was, um, and it's been something that like I've always wanted to do since being here and walking from installation to installation and seeing, uh, everyone's world, basically. And I, I just always dreamed of one day showing here as well. Um, and when I think back before I knew I wanted to be an artist, I had heard of Mattress Factory. I went to school here in Pittsburgh uh, and middle school here on the north side in high school. And we took trips here, but I never went because I was on the math and science tracks and those were most of my electives. So uh, I just remember finally <laughs> seeing the Mattress Factory in my old age <laughs> and just being like feeling like I missed out on like knowing about it earlier and it like um, being a part of my my life earlier um, but I'm really really grateful for the opportunity to show here uh, I would say that it the experience was beyond my dreams